Well, welcome back to my shed. Today we had the uh, frame and the leg shields blasted and it showed up a few bits and pieces around here. The welding around here, there was a big thick plate both sides. So when I went to put on the running board, you couldn't get it to line up because it was hitting this. So I cut those out. They weren't really doing anything, but I cut them out anyway. But what I've done is I've made this up, and that will fit underneath and support across. So when I turn it over, I'll, I'll show you that. Right, so level these out and everything. There's a bit here where the welds are. It's all blasted out. So I'll, uh, I don't know if that's my welds or that was the original weld marks. Um, but I'll uh, weld those up, make good, and as well as make good in there. Up here. There's a little bit around here. I've got make make good there, make good there, make make good on that one. There's a little bit around that side. Just got to make good on these. Right, so there's a, a dink there and some well marks again. Yeah. So that ain't too bad. Make all make good this. Just got to clean it up, clean the edges up, and then touch a weld in there but then when I run the plate across there I might run the bead in and then just fill that bit that's fine fitted this um, to see how they went because I've never had a GP so I don't know how they went and uh, I found out how exactly how they go so that's all right. That was, that was a bit of a mission trying to work out. If you've never had one, I don't know if you've if any if you've ever done one, but that was a bit of a mission to work out how they went. Yeah, I'll just throw this side panel on. And I'll show you. There you go. Um, that's how it goes. Like that. And it holds it down. Uh, neat little system to replace the handles. But yeah. But well, like I say, not having a GP before, didn't know how they went. But yeah, that's perfect.